Hey, how's it going guys? This is Fury and welcome back to Modded Terraria <laughs> and buff and we're gonna pop this. Oh wow. Okay. Here's the perforators. Nice. <laughs> and they're partying. Oh wow. They're having a little party over here. That's awesome. <laughs> Obviously, uh, between episodes, oh no, there's fire all over the place. That's not cool. Here, let me debuff you a little bit. I'm just gonna spam this all over the place. Nice, okay, so he's gonna launch me. Let me cast another one of these up there. Uh, yeah, so between episodes, I made this granite armor. I'm gonna heal now, just in case. And, oh no, I'm confused. <laughs> made the granite armor, and uh, I made these granite throwing axes. Oh wow, this is tough. Tough. Here, hold on, let me debuff you. Oh, I'm hexed. Oh no. Give me those hearts. I got hearts over here too. How come I can't attack? I'm still hexed. Alright, there we go. I gotta stay away from that fire. <laughs> and just spam everything I can. I oh, I'm hexed again? Oh no. <laughs> Give me these hearts. Um, here, hurry up. Let's... I don't know which one was hexing me. I think one of the little ones. Oh, is he dead? Oh, I got him? Wait a minute. What's going on? <laughs> One of these things is hexing me. There's a million of them. <laughs> Go away. Let me attack you. <laughs> Why can't I attack? All right. I don't know what's going on, but something. <laughs> Where's my treasure bag, buddy? Do I have to kill all these guys for it to drop? Here. That's not helping. All right. Blighted gel. Uh, did I already pick up the treasure bag and I just didn't see it? Maybe. Okay, well that was interesting. Oh, there's still one left. Come here. Where are you? Oh, you're dead. Okay. Um, so yeah, use the granite armor now. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it on all the time. Maybe just for bosses because uh, it move. it's very slow. Ugh. Ugh, I can't move. See, look at that. Oh, but wait, I'm not, I don't have my boots on. That's why. But still, even with the, uh, even with the boots, I have to dash in order to gain any speed. And yeah, where's the treasure bag? There it is. Nice. I was like, no way. No way. Okay. So also between episodes, let me just see this. Open, go. Ooh, vein buster. That's cool. It shoots blood all over the place. What's this? Blood clot staff? Summon? Oh, uh, yeah. Negative damage, though. Let me just check it. That's all. So I didn't have any of my summons out. What a silly guy. Here, let me get this. And let me get these guys. All right. And bloody worm tooth. 7% increased damage reduction and increased melee stats. 14% increased damage reduction and melee stats when below 50% life. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Well, I'm not going to use any of that yet. <laughs> For now, we'll use it. But between episodes, other than making the granite armor, something happened. Finally, guys, where are you? Here you are. I haven't looked at him yet. I have not even talked to him. Come here. Stop running away. Don't run away from your destiny, Salavat. Salam can't come. Do you need anything? Sorry, I butchered that. <laughs> Genie lamp. Oh my god. Yes, I'm buying that. Java hood and robe. <laughs> that looks awesome. Sandstone ring. 5% increased melee damage and critical strike chance. Fossil sugar! Desert crown, okay. He sells bone javelins and bone throwing knives. 
Whoa. Okay, but this... Alright. I'm so sorry, Bill. Wait, hold on. Hey, Bill. I'm sorry about this, but we need to, uh... Oh, nice. Yes, wow, this is faster on the ground. Uh, still cheesy jump jumps. Okay. Genie lamp. Um, oh wow, sweet, oh man, look, hey buddy, I've got the genie on top, uh, he's riding on top of luggage, <laughs> anyway, let's run down into the mushroom biome real quick and see, nice, yeah, this is super fast, that's awesome, very cool, I don't know if he, he probably can't run on water though, huh, that's alright, it's not like I used Bill all the time. <laughs> Alright, so... Also, that's awesome. The genie. What does the genie do? He's just a light pet? Ah, so cool. Okay. Blighted gel. Also, between episodes, I pretty much finished the base. I mean, it's it's not finished, but it's it's close to being finished. And I added wings to Slimy. So now little Slimy's got his wings. Here, let's open the map real quick. Yeah. They look kind of funny. I don't really like the way the wings look, but people requested it. <laughs> but, I mean, it looks cool. It looks cool. It, I guess it does look cooler than building, like, a little hill out of, like, background, like, dirt wall and grass wall and stuff. Because I have this here, this bridge here anyway, that might have gotten in the way. Anyway, so yeah, slimy wings, sweet. And all right, let me just get rid of this stuff that I have on me real quick. Okay, guys, so we're going to make some stuff. The drops from him, uh, we're probably not going to use them yet. Although, I want to see this stuff. He dropped this blood sample, or they dropped, because perforators are more than one worm. It's a bunch of them. Okay, Aorta. Yo-yo. Bloodbath. Drench your foes in blood. Alright. Blood clot staff. We got that. Same thing with uh, the vein buster. Right? We don't have this other stuff. Tooth ball. Oh, okay. I can make this Knight's Ray. I want to make that. Fires a beam of dark energy that can split into additional beams. Enemies must be near for the beam to split. Yeah, we're going to make that because we're going to head to the corruption very soon. Very soon. Eviscerator. 60 range damage. Wait, this has to be uh, late. What? Wait, hold on. Four vertebra, vertebrae, four crimtane, an aided. Wait, what? 60 range damage at a demon altar? There has to be a catch. Wait, so hold on here. <laughs> I can make this. Four and four. Okay, um. Hang on a minute. Let me grab that real quick. <laughs> what? You gotta be kidding me. Four and four. Look at that. We have plenty of materials, guys. I got tons. Tons and tons. All right. So I wanted to make this, this golden desert eagle, uh, because I was like, oh, that's probably a pretty cool gun because I want to use a gun, guys. I love the guns. Love guns. I'm still going to make that until we make this eviscerator, which is going to probably be extremely overpowered. All right. Golden desert eagle. Uh, Sure. Sighted. That's cool. All right, hang on. Look how big it is. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's like an arm cannon. Yeah. That's awesome. Okay. Burns through my ammo though. All right. So there's that. And all right. Yeah. I can make Thor's hammer. I'm gonna make this. Cause I like switching it up. Thor's hammer melee. Forty two melee damage. 12 critical critical strike chance. Average, average. It's a material. Okay. We're going to have to go check that out real soon. Ah, oh, it's not auto swing. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Maybe I'm not using this. 
<laughs> uh, okay. Man, it's not auto swing. What is this? Thor's hammer ranged. Oh, I could turn into a ranged weapon. 31. Eh, you know, whatever. We're gonna keep it where it is. Magic? Oh, interesting. We're just gonna keep it melee for now. Okay. Something else that I noticed that I could make. This bootleg crystal fountain. We're making that. Uh, I'm assuming that... Like, I'm gonna be making my own crystal biome, guys. So... I'm probably gonna use this, and hopefully we can summon the boss with this. Maybe, um, I think... These are the stabs I need. I could make the other one, but we're gonna hold off on that for now. Or I could save up some more Hellstone and make the, um, what do you call it? The bow. But for now, okay, for now, <laughs> we're doing this. We're making the Eviscerator and that other one. Okay. Because that's crazy. Totally crazy. All right, let's go. What I also did, guys, yeah. I have a lot more auto farms that I set up. A shark auto farm. Bombs. Slimes for gel. Uh, the spiders, I got like a chest full of arachnophobia swords for money, I guess. I don't know if they drop anything else. Skeletons. Come here. <laughs> the um, blood zombies. Penguins, of course. Uh, jellyfish and the granite guys, granite elementals. Look, oh, I, I took it out, but um, they're dropping tons of granite blocks, so I have like infinite. Wow, you just did a somersault! Nice. What's up, Jackie Chan fish? Okay, anyway, <laughs> uh, so I had a bunch, I have infinite granite blocks, which is awesome, so I can make some huge granite builds if I want to. Alright, so I ended up doing a little bit more decorating in here. That's ready to go. I mean, I'm gonna do more, of course, especially up in the little attic areas. Uh, don't think I really did much in here. No. That's what I did. Yeah. Didn't do anything here yet. I did this. I made our... Uh, obsidian and honey block generator. Very cool. That took a little while to make, but, uh, very glad that I made that. Because now making hellstone bars is going to be no problem. So I did that. I ended up taking most of the doors out and replacing them with this actuating glass. Because it helps keep some of the enemies out. What's up, party people? All right. In here, this is just our little central motif, central thing. Uh, and I'm gonna put crafting stations all around here. I have to wait until I can make another teleporter, guys, before I really turn this into our base. Here. Got a, an exit out over here on both sides. I like being able to, when I'm building something this big, I like being able to easily move throughout the whole thing. What is hitting me? Uh oh. Hello. <laughs> so I like, you know, making it so I can go through the bottom, middle, top, in a few different areas. Some kind of little bell type of thing. It's not really a bell. Anyway, so this is going to be my room up here eventually. Soon enough. But <laughs> what I want to make real quick. Oh, yeah. Is uh, this one goes out. To all you guys who pointed out the fact that I didn't kill the pinky in my Improve Your Starter House video. <laughs> I'm going to make a pinky cage and pop that down. Aw, oh, man. I can't put it on there? Alright, we'll put it next to the bed for now. Man, I can't put it on a dresser. But yeah, now we're always going to have a pinky right next to our spawn point. <laughs> Just mocking us. You'll never be able to kill me now. <laughs> All right. Um, and then, okay. Up here, get away, is where the wizard's tower is going to be. Yeah. But actually, what I want to do, since it is 
it's raining out and looks kind of dreary. What I want to do real fast also is because we never killed this guy in expert mode. Hopefully I could summon him during the day. I can't use it during the day. Man. Okay, well, I'll meet you guys here at night. Okay, it's nighttime. Let me summon him. Boom. Oh, okay. Here, take that. And we're just going to do this. <laughs> Look at that. Just watch the UFO just destroy him. Oh, he's regenerating. He's a... Oh, he regenerates automatically. But he's dead. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that was a quick fight, guys. <laughs> uh, we got the treasure bag, though. And some stone blocks. Somehow. Alright, so, treasure bag. What do we have here? Evil corn mask? Oh, man, that's going on. For the... <laughs> nice. Corn heater? Wow. 29 range damage. It's cursed. Of course it's cursed. Stop taking all this stuff. Alright. Yes, let's go! <laughs> Look at me! Woo! <laughs> okay. Let me get rid of all the stuff, and then we're gonna go to the corruption and uh, make the eviscerator, I guess, and then eviscerate the hive mind, I think. I think it's about that time, guys. Alright, guys. Let me just... We didn't check this. <laughs> I love this mask. Look at that. I love the evil corn. It's so awesome. <laughs> It's my favorite boss so far, guys. Not really, but yeah, it is. It's awesome. Nah, the uh, Desert Scourge was amazing, too. They've all been amazing. All right, so... Is it just ranged and magic? Yeah. This weapon's not that great. <laughs> uh, should I make the magic one or ranged? I'm going to make the ranged one, I think. And see if I like that better. Because it's not auto-swing, and, uh, yeah. Let's make the ranged one. Boom. That's cool. We can switch it back and forth as many times as we want. Okay, so it's like the paladin's hammer. Oh, wow. Okay, I like that. That's really cool. Sweet. Okay. Let's go! Ow. <laughs> ah, come on. To the corruption, and time to destroy something. Time to eviscerate. Eviscerator. Like, are you kidding me? 78 range damage? What? Like, what is that even about? What is going on here? Hold on. Okay, so it's pretty slow. Snail speed. High velocity. Well, we're gonna try it, guys. Alright. Let me make the... I think I quick stacked my other thing by accident. Alright, we'll be right back. <laughs> I quick stacked stuff that I need. Yeah! Okay. So, uh, I quick stacked the boss summoner, but it turns out I can't make that staff. This one, or whatever. because With these, because I need, instead of the... Vile Thorn, I need the uh, Crimson Staff. So, we're not going to make that yet. Uh, but I did quick stack the boss spawners. We're not fighting the boss down here. We're going to go up to the surface. Come on. Alright, because I prepared this little flat area. It's not really an arena. Hopefully it, it works decently. Um, okay, I think I might be ready. What's that? Ah, oh, cool, they changed the sprite for the ancient fossil. I was like, oh. Alright, so let's uh, do this. I'm just gonna cast that right now. And... Let's go! And buff! Alright, let's eviscerate this guy. Oh, hello! Nice. Well, hopefully he's not so easy. Oh, wow, what's going on? Yes, we got stuff. Where are you? We got these, he's casting these rain clouds at us. Nice. And he's summoning a bunch of 
thingies, a bunch of little helpers. I just got snailed or slowed. <laughs> but uh, he doesn't seem all that difficult yet. Especially if I do this, and then this, and then eviscerate. <laughs> oh man. This is like a pre-hard mode sniper rifle, the eviscerator. Alright, is this it? Does he have an enraged form? He probably does, right? I'm like, this is... Oh, he is! He's infuriated. Hey, buddy. You can't get infuriated at fury. Okay, I'm out of ammo, or out of magic, never mind. He's dead! You are dead, Sunny. Sunny G. Nice, okay. Um, treasure bag... Go! Warding Rotten Brain. Increased attack stats and decreased movement speed as health drops. Huh. Interesting. Alright. What else? You dropped Demonite Bars, of course. True Shadow Scales. Now I can make that staff. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna fight him again. I'm gonna make that staff and then fight him again. Alright. Yes! What is that? Shade Thrower? Oh, man. <laughs> we got stuff we can make. Perfect Dark. Oh, wait. I can make... Oh, that's not it. It's this. The Knight's Ray. Alright, let's make this. 35. Cool. And what are we going to get rid of? The Eviscerator for now and use this instead. Yeah, we're going to get rid of the Corn thingy. Alright. Yes, genie. That's cool. The genie, you can't equip him in your, like, pet slots, either one of them. But, uh, he stays there because I left the world and I came back. And he stayed. So, that's cool. I guess he'll, he'll be here until I die. That's awesome. Alright. Let's just get this other stuff away from the junk stuff down here. Alright, let's do this. Time to, uh... What is this? Time to hit you with- What?! Oh my god. Are you serious? <laughs> okay, wow. This thing is pretty awesome, guys. There's still this other magic staff I want to make. This isn't even, like, the main magic staff. Here, keep refilling my mana, please. Let's just spam this. Keep summoning things to refill my mana for me. That would be awesome. Did I already kill him? No, oh, he's still here. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. This is pretty awesome. Come here. The evil corn is going to destroy your face. <laughs> Look at him, giant eater. So is the genie attack? I don't think he does. I think he's just like a light pet, right? Oh, I'm slow. There. This is awesome. I love, like, having really fast firing weapons. Like, look at that. That's incredible, guys. Oh, man. Next episode, we're gonna have this. I'm gonna switch back to the magic sword. <laughs> Let's do some more eviscerating on your face. I love this mask. It's so cool. I might actually keep this mask on for a while. Thanks, troll. Thanks a lot. Here. This is what you get. You get completely destroyed by everything. By me. Alright, so... Gimme. Ah, oh, I'm full of stuff. Anyway, treasure bag. Anything new? Go! Rot balls. And another rotted brain. Sweet. Rot balls throwing damage. That's cool. Nice. All right. Sweetness. Cool. And we got uh, Ancient Shadow Greaves. Nice. Okay, guys. Yes. <laughs> this is so awesome. Uh, looks like that's time for now. Fought uh, a few bosses. Fought one Perforators. We're going to fight another one soon. Two Hive Mines. Fought the Evil Corn. Got the Evil Corn Mask. Yes. Got this guy finally. Finally, you show up. 
And next episode, we're going to go down into the underworld and start preparing things down there. Getting pretty close to getting into hard mode. There's a few things I want to do before then. But uh, yeah, hopefully I can find another uh, cloud in the bottle because I need one of those to make another teleporter. So I can just teleport right to my bedroom area up here down to the uh, chest sphere where I keep all my items. It will make it very convenient. And then I'll move in here. I'll set my spawn here permanently, you know, right next to our little pet pinky. <laughs> Uh, yeah, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I'm going to go through all this stuff and see what weapons I want to use, what not. Definitely this. This is pretty amazing, I must say. I'm not sure about the Eviscerator. It's cool. It's definitely cool. But then there's this. I got to buy more ammo. I'm wasting it all right now. Anyway, guys, all right. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out.